Hello, good evening all. Welcome to Informative. This video, I would like to do it in English so that a lot of people can, can get benefit out of this uh, video. Okay, I have a lens. My lens is a Canon uh, 18 to 135mm Nano USM. So this lens uh, got another brother. Uh, the older one is the uh, same range. EFS 18 to 135 but that one is using the STM Moto. This one the newer version that using the Nano USM Moto. And this lens got a contact here. Uh, this contact uh, is used to attach with the power zoom adapter called PZE1 uh, also from Canon. So the only lens that can use with that PZE1 is the this adapter and this lens only. No other lens that can accept the the both of the thing. So this package uh, actually in Malaysia we still can get this uh, PZE1, but in Malaysia uh, they sell about 900 ringgit Malaysian ringgit 900. Then um, it's quite expensive because the lens also I bought second hand costing about 800 ringgit but the PZE1 new is 900 more than 900 ringgit then uh, can recently the Canon Malaysia got do some maybe clearance sales they sell for six almost 700 ringgit uh, but still expensive for me so this this item PZE1 I bought from Indonesia the website from Indonesia so the website is called bulapak.id some sort like that so when I'm searching for this PZE1 so I look into the website I saw that they sell it for 500,000 rupiah if let's say you convert to Malaysian ringgit it's about 100 and less than 150 ringgit so I said wow uh, very cheap but I don't know whether uh, actual product or not. Uh, the problem with the website, it cannot send direct from Indonesia to Malaysia. Then, uh, I still want to purchase this thing. So I contact my friend uh, from Indonesia and asking her that whether she can help me or not to use her address so that the website can post to her. Then I need perhaps to send this uh, product to me in Malaysia so she agree thank God she agree so this product is sent from Pariaman Tengah Sula, Sumatra Barat this one of my friend address uh, so uh, we are using the Indonesian tourist service they call they call it Tiki Tiki quite good uh, actually this is the only uh, only courier service that want to send to Malaysia the rest I seem like they don't want to cooperate they don't want to send uh, any electronic products to Malaysia I tried to search for JNT but JNT wasn't available there only for Indonesian market they send but for Malaysian they are not sending to Malaysia so I use Tiki uh, actually they sent from I bought from Bulapa on I cannot remember the date but the item arrived on 1st of August then this item sent to Malaysia to me on 2nd of August then today 12th of August the item arrived to me so I do the unboxing hopefully what is inside here is the actual PZA1 the original one so I take my knife and we try to open it Okay, now I already got my knife, then we continue unboxing this package and hopefully that this package is the actual, the original Canon one. I think maybe the, they do, they do the sale in Indonesia because this product is actually, the actual product is about, if I'm not mistaken, around 5 years old. Uh, but not a lot of people buying this actually 
especially in Malaysia market maybe in Indonesia market also but uh, to me it's a good initiative by Canon to, to make this kind of products for the Canon video shooter to use this lens as a video uh, lens for photography lens I don't think that this lens uh, this uh, adapter is uh, got a variety of use but for video shooter this is definitely the game changer uh, I think if you are out there using the camera and together with this lens I will sure that you will be uh, like to use the power zoom so this is a power zoom adapter it looks like the original one it looks like similar to the original one uh, here they say the written Canon power zoom adapter PZE1 and here all the description in few other languages I don't know whether you can see or not yeah then power zoom adapter PZE1 and this is Canon Incorporated I don't know whether it's original or not Taiwan it look like it original I don't know let's open it previously in Indonesia they already opened it because before sent to Malaysia they need to open to verify what the thing inside this before the sending so I believe they already open now we reopen again so they, they include that the, the bag small bag some uh, the manual books uh, I think this one warranty card maybe I cannot use because I order from Indonesia uh, it's supposed to come together with a battery but uh, the battery the AA battery triple A battery cannot be sent together with this product then uh, I just then ask them to send only this uh, PZE one so it look like the original from Canon I don't know whether they they have made the the local one or not power zoom adapter made in Taiwan so it look good this is the contact cover uh, the battery they are not sent together this is the battery compartment so they use the triple A battery whether you can see or not triple A battery supposed to be go there so let me uh, take the battery and we try this thing out so we continue we already got the triple A battery this one is a rechargeable one but I don't know whether it still have a juice in it or not so we show you the the, the Porsche, Porsche bag that comes together with the PZE1 this is actually the carrying case also have some what is this oh this, this is the the receipt from the company that I purchased this so they sell it for 500 rupiah it's about less than 150 ringgit to get the the postage the everything is maybe it costs around 550 something uh, from that company to the my friend house is about 150 something then from her house to Malaysia costing about 100 ringgit and I also give her some 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 token to help me it's about 150 or so I finished that so this product actually I bought for around 320 ringgit only included the postage everything if I buy from Malaysia it cost me about 900 ringgit so I can save a lot 
what to do if let's say maybe the Malaysian market selling a lot cheaper or maybe maybe around 400 ringgit I think maybe I bought from them but you know uh, as a consumer we must find out try to save the money as much as we can uh, so that we can get the value of money you know now the to get money is not easy uh, so when you're not using it just keep it keep it like that when you know planning to use the the adapter so when you want to use the adapter you open the lock you can see the contact point over there there's a contact point so here on the lens also have a contact point so this thing supposed to be aligned like so like so I'm so not family oh we need to open the locks guys already open open the lock put it there it's supposed to be nice and snug when it's already there okay then lock it in positions like that so put in the battery it's supposed to be like this negative positive yeah negative positive we close it back uh, actually we need to attach it to this camera which one I'm using so I change to my another camera then we try this power zoom before we try this power zoom on this camera so we just show you what they have so here is a lock then it has a, a zoom button white and tele this one if let's say you want to choose manual zoom or power zoom and this one is slow or fast uh, zooming that's all the lock you need to press then only you can turn without pressing you cannot turn so it can avoid accidentally uh, maybe unlock it so the bottom side and the battery side so with this attached also we still can play around with the zooming focus ring also working zoom also working this one under manual zoom this one power zoom uh, when you on the power zoom it cannot be it cannot be turned then when you choose uh, MZ MZ is manual zoom and you can zoom in just like that so that's mean this this uh, attachment can be there even though you don't want to use it the power as a power zoom power zoom you cannot do anything also you cannot play around with this when you attach the camera then only you can uh, activate or trigger the power zoom so now i'm going to change the camera then we will try this uh, lens together with this camera i'm using the canon m6 mark ii uh, with the lens adapter it's supposed to be okay with the lens supposed to be okay we are changing now okay now i'm changing to my another camera this one is the osmo pocket one the first version the original one so this is my canon m6 mark ii currently i'm using i'm attaching it with the uh, sigma 16 mm 1.4 so i'm going to remove this lamp make sure we offer so you're already off then i put this aside put the camera also aside the, oh yeah I need to take the uh, what do you call it the 
adapter. Okay, this lens must have the adapter. Uh, I'm using the Canon adapter. It must use the what they call it, Canon EF two EOS M. And only you can use the EFS or EF lens to go together with the Canon M6 Mark II. Okay, mostly I use this lens for video video work. That's why I'm using it. Okay, if you see, I already attached this lens with Canon M6 Mark II. This lens is big lens for a small camera. When I power on the camera, okay, you can see the light is turning on. So you must on the camera, then only the PZE1 is functioning. So this is the slow zoom. You can see the lens moving forward. And this one. Uh, backward very very slow okay this one is the fast I can switch to the fast yeah but it's it sound a little bit harsh quite loud when zooming I think maybe this is uh, will appear on your uh, video recording if you're using the power zoom maybe i stick to slow zoom this much more quieter okay i'm happy with this purchase normally i do the car review product car review or uh, maybe i use this lens if let's say i don't want to use the gimbal i use the power zoom lens and maybe if I go for vacation, I want to take some sceneries, I want to show the audience uh, the place that I'm going, maybe I use this design also. Uh, yeah, see, if let's say you want to see a video that uh, taken by using the zoom lens, I put the link in the description soon when the video is ready. Then you can see over there how the quality of the zooming uh, it's supposed to be that's it for now from me uh, thank you for watching and if you like this video if this video informative just give us a thumbs up or maybe just consider subscribing thank you for watching see you again in another video bye bye for now